Welcome to Love and You. My name's Louise and today I've got a real treat for you. If you should recognise this dress, it's a replica of Kate Middleton's wedding dress, which has become a fashion icon really. Um, it's designed by Maury Lee um, by Madeleine Gardner. So as you can see, it's truly for the bride who wants something quite spectacular. Um, we've got a very long cathedral length train and lovely lace detail, long sleeve v-neck. If you compare it to pictures of Kate Middleton's um, wedding dress, you'll see it really is quite similar. So I'll just go over in quite a bit of detail. This is the next store sample. It's no longer um, available in shops, so you'll be truly unique with this dress. And I'll just go down. Let you have a good look at the front. Box pleat skirts, uh, which I don't really get many box pleats. Sorry, just trying to get in focus for you. Many box pleat um, skirt wedding designs, but it's really elegant, um, feminine kind of design. And the whole bottom has lovely um, lace work and beading on it as well. And that goes all around the edges. And as you can see with the sleeve, um, we don't have an arm in it unfortunately, but um, it comes down in a bit of a point. So it really will look really nice and elegant when it's on. And if I take you, show you a bit of the train here. Wow, that is a lot of material. Sorry, I've got a skylight in so it's messing up the the lighting a bit but you can see all the work that has gone into this dress it is absolutely stunning so if you want a long sleeve wedding dress which are really fashionable these days and uh, quite an epic train this is the dress for you I'll take another video of the back just to go over that in a bit more detail but gives you an idea. Um, so you could either wear this with a hoop um, or without. Now to be honest I don't have a hoop underneath it. It's got a little bit of a netting but I have kind of stuck some pillows there um, just to give it a bit of uh, puff it out a little bit. But you could either just go quite simple with it or um, put a nice big hoop underneath it. It's completely up to you. Okay, so we'll finish there and I shall um, turn around and give you a good view of the back. 